Hello YouTube. Today I will show you how to make an induction heater from a simple 12 volt power supply and copper wire. First, I check the performance of the power supply and the output voltage. Next, disassemble the case. I take out the board. I need to solder the transformer off the board. For this I use copper wire and solder the wire to all the outputs of the power supply, warm it up with two soldering irons and remove the transformer. This method is good in the absence of a tin suction device. It is necessary to remove the insulation from the transformer. I use copper wire with a diameter of 0.9 millimeters. It is necessary to make two turns and tighten tightly. I solder the transformer back to the board.
and isolate the outputs to avoid a short circuit on the middle case. Next, install the board in place of attachment and assemble the case. I make a coil from the same wire, 0 to 9 mm. 10 turns around the pin and leave conclusions 3 to 4 cm long. I made the first coil with 1 cm leads. As a result, it had to be redone, because due to strong heating, the closely located soldering point simply disconnected. Solder and insulate with heat shrink tubing. I decided to use an ordinary 12 volt car lamp from a brake light as a load. It was not possible to heat the drill to red, but it still heats up very strongly. Later as a load, I use a high-speed fan from mining equipment with a PWM controller. It is important to apply a load to the 12-volt output of the power supply otherwise my induction heater will not work. In my case, heating to the red color occurs in 25 to 30 seconds, while the fan speed is set to maximum for maximum load. Thank you for your attention, see you soon.